on here. Just like the caption said before, there's not going to be a lot of dialogue in this series. Maybe a little bit for banter, but other than that, it's all going to be edits. Hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to like and subscribe. Please help the Don. of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47. Jesus, come on. Quit busting my balls already. <laughs> Topside temperature is 93 degrees, with an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. Black Mesa Hazard Course Decathlon 
will commence this evening at 1900 hours in the level three facility. The semi-finals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure access transmission. Remember, more lives than your own may depend on your fitness. who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team. Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruitment division. The Black Mesa Research Facility is an equal opportunity employer. research facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you and have a very safe and productive day. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. I guess his bar tab must have finally caught up with him. Put some pep in that step, Freeman. You're late enough as it is. Mr. Freeman, I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Uh, hold, just hold on for one moment why taking this shit in your pants right here we can talk at lunch boy. i don't think so has anyone actually even seen your degree freeman at least i have one get away from there freeman i'm expecting an important message you know you got shit trailing behind you Gordon, don't touch that. Go use another computer. Hey. Who are you talking to? We can talk later, Gordon. Hey. 
it's happening? Cut it out. What the hell is going on up there? My horoscope was correct. Did someone pull the fire alarm or something? Come on, Gordon. What are you trying to do? Get me into trouble? Bertal, Bertal, come in. Yeah, yeah, I'm here. What the hell is going on up there? Uh, we had a little accident up here, sorry. Yeah, well, that better be the last accident you have today. Understood? Ah, uh, copy. Damn, Gordon. What are you doing still running around up here? My job. I can't be bothered right now. <laughs> Good morning, Dr. Freeman. Earlier. Hello. The thermal protection system seems to be online now. Those TPS reports have gotten progressively worse. Hard to find oh, good help Oh, you these look days. at that. Freeman yes, actually no. did show up for work this We're morning. Going to need you to Looks come like somebody again. here owes what? me lunch. Good morning, plans. Freeman. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm always laughs> <attempt the next>. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Yep, yep, yep. There's a pepperoni pizza in my near future. Yes. If you choke on it. <laughs> the sample was just sent down to the test chamber. Big day today, eh, Freeman? Good morning, Gordon. Hello. I'm not one for idle chatter, Gordon. You say that, but you were talking to someone earlier. That's considered idle chatter. Dumbass. Fucking PhD. Doesn't even know what idle chatter is. You know what? Oh, come on. Did that honestly seem like a good idea, Gordon? You forgot to carry the two, or was it the three? Got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. You know I can't let you through here. living in the past. That experiment is single-handedly responsible for inspiring my career in science. How much recognition do you think you're going to get for reproduction, though? You should focus on inventing something new and unique. He does have a point. Oh, but this is more than replication, I assure you. For one, it shows how far our field has come since the original study was published, and to say nothing of the modern perspective necessary to monitor its influence. I mean, combined with today's technology, I've recreated- Bah! I can't stand to hear another word of this malarkey. Don't mind him, but here's something to think about for the next time. You and your sugar-coated airsots are absolutely full of it! Creativity is the art of hiding your influence. Now let's get back to work. We should at least try to look busy. This is going to have to wait, Gordon. Hello, Dr. Cross. If this is anything less than a full-scale Code Red calamity, I'm not interested. Debugging procedure coming along. Another day, another dollar. Can this wait till I'm off break? 
No. You think you can fix the vending machine too, college boy? We will never hear the end of this. Yeah, you best make like an atom and split. Cause uh, that was, um, that was you know who's lunch. You can choke on it. Freeman, you're not doing anything. I need my magnificent microwave casserole. If you pull this off, I might just forgive you for that debacle involving a certain rocket. Oh, there's another bit of cruft we can ignore. Support equipment powered down. Guidance, computer voltages, and currents. Freeman! Ah! Oh, my rocket! What are you waiting for, Freeman? Where do you think you're going, Freeman? This way, Freeman. Over here. Hurry up or I'll do it myself, for God's sake. By all means, take your time. There is no time to waste. Bible of Earth depends Don't you understand the gravity of the situation? Much better. Not so fast, Mr. Gorgeous. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? <sighs> Regret. No toilet paper. You know what? I'm gonna be nice. Uh, hello? Hello? Could somebody- Oh, thank heavens! I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. Remember my days in the hazardous environment suit? through sir looks like you're in the barrel today ah <sighs> like you wouldn't believe hi gordon do 
I know you? Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down. Eli has been busy making last-minute preparations for the new experiment. Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon, good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last-minute changes, they're a bit strange to just... Oh, it's about to go critical. What in the blazes is going on with our equipment? Oh, it was never meant to do this in the first place. Oh. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. Beckrell's ghost. The radiation level is off the charts as far from the glory. Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Ah, here he is. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And potentially the most unstable. Now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't feel... Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Moot with the face watching this video. Like and subscribe. Comment down below. Make sure to share the video with other people that you like so the Don can have more viewers, more followers. I'll see you guys in the next video.